I'm so dumb. So, turns out, dudes, that I got reported to Ms. Harrison and Ms. Lanchi, which, those of you that don't know them, they are in charge of student council, which means I'm pretty sure I'm going to get fired tomorrow. So, before I get fired, I quit. And, uh, so people who keep showing them my stories, go ahead and show them that. And, Ms. Harrison and Ms. Yeager, I'm pretty sure you're going to show Ms. Lanchi this, too. Because I'm pretty sure, because someone said I already got reported for my, for drinking in my own house, my own apartment. Right, okay. Okay, okay, yeah. So, uh, here's the thing. Ms. Lechi, this is going to be the fourth time, fourth or third time you guys have got on me for doing what I want in my house. So yes, I'm fucking done. If I get in trouble tomorrow, I swear to God, I'm fucking dropping out because when I got suspended for the pat, when I got suspended last three days, my grades have dropped rapidly. Very, very bad. Not my fault. Your guys' fault because you won't let me fucking live my life. I'm, I'm so fucking serious, dead ass. If I get in trouble tomorrow for doing what I want in my apartment, I am so taking Havelock High School to fucking court with my parents. And you, and you guys do not fucking want that. But that ass, I am full on warning you guys because last time I checked, Murphy said some girl took the school to court because she ordered pizza at the high school. I'm gonna take you guys I'm gonna take you guys to court for fucking up my life because you won't let me do what I want in my own apartment. Let's see how well that goes. Like Havoc High School acts like they're cops. You act like you guys are the law. You're not. I And I hate to be a fucking a douche. I hate to be a douchebag, Miss Lanchi. I truly do. I love all the staff members. APs, everyone. But it's bullshit like this that makes me don't like you guys. It's stuff like this that makes me mad at you guys. And then, and then you try and turn my anger on me. Jason, I don't like your tone. Well, I wouldn't have a tone if you guys would just stay out of my life. And then, on top of everything, on top of everything, you guys will still say, Jason, well, you're not 21. I don't fucking care. And then, on top of everything, on top of everything, you guys will still say, Jason, well, you're not 21. I don't fucking care. I don't care. Everyone on this fucking planet drinks when they're not 21. Everyone posts. People even post, people even post worse shit than I do. So, yeah, get off my back. Just, just stop. And this is a direct message to the staff, APs and all, Ms. Yeager, all of you. I'm going to keep posting what I want on my Snapchat. When I want, wherever I want. As long as it's not in that school, or has to do anything with that school or anybody in it, you should have no say-so over my life. And I fucking mean that. So stay out of it. And, uh, so I've decided to release some unsaid information about what happened after I got suspended to the public right now to you guys that don't know. Um... So, yeah, so I got in trouble because during my uh, three-day suspension, remember, do you guys remember, like, just think back, remember when I posted on my story that it was a three-day vacation? Yeah, I got in trouble for that. <laughs> I got in trouble for that. And I'm drawing the line here. I truly am. I truly am. I should have drawn it there, but I get, try to give you, I try to be nice again, play by your rules. Not anymore. I'm so fucking done. I'm so done. You know what? You know what? Every time one of you APs slip up, every time one of you teachers slip up, I'm just gonna snitch. I'm just gonna go tell Dr. Murphy. Or the fucking, or the, uh, Board of Education. How's that? And another thing! Here is, here, here is an amazing reason. Here, here's one thing, here's one thing. Havelock High School, APs, all of you. Instead of worrying about Jason Gibbs and what I do, why don't you go 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 worry about the people? Because I know there's wor there are so much worse people on Snapchat who post so much worse shit. Go fuck with them. Stay out of my life. Literally, I just quit my fucking position on the council. I quit. So now I'm gonna post whatever the hell I want to. Literally, people, everyone, they. I actually think that me, me, Jason Gibbs, was a role model for that fucking school.
okay, I am not a role model for that school. I'm a role model for people, not that school. The people are not that school. The people are their own person. I'm not a role model for you APs or teachers. Instead of worrying about me, instead of coming after me, why don't you go after and stop the bullies in your school? Like I tried to do. But in the end, I get in trouble for it. That shit had me so fucking fired up. You have no idea. I was ready to raise hell in that office, but I didn't. Because I respect you guys. I respect the staff. Unlike some other people where they would have literally flipped the fucking desk or the table. But no, I am so done. I am, I've tolerated enough. Enough. And the fact that my parents don't even know what you guys did, they don't even know. Oh, but they're going to fucking know now. And my mom's going to have to fly all the way out from Miami. And my dad's going to have to fly all the way out from uh, fucking wherever he is right now. New York, probably. That's where he said he was going. Dude, they're going to raise fucking high hell. And I promise to you, Havelock High School, you are not going to fucking win. You are not going to win this one. So just fucking stay out of my life. Another thing. Why, why the, why the hell do APs keep, keep, why is it APs? Why can't I get Murphy? Or are you guys, or do you guys know that what you do, what you're doing to me is so retarded that Murphy won't even care? Like so. Oh, serious. So fucking serious. I bet you if you, I bet you Miss Lanchi and Miss Yeager and Miss Harrison, all of you, if you want to go, if you want to go show Dr. Murphy that I said that my three suspension days were vacation days, he would laugh probably, or he just wouldn't even say anything. He'd be like, Let, listen up staff, we have bigger problems. Yeah, you do. You have much bigger problems than me. You guys tell me all the time, but yet you keep fucking with my life. And then, and then, bro, when I go to school tomorrow, ten dollars, ten fucking dollars says that Miss Lanchi or whoever calls me to their office is gonna be like, Jason, Mr. Gibbs, we didn't, we weren't even gonna, we weren't even gonna do anything. We weren't gonna do anything until until you made the statement that you're gonna take us to court. But now we're gonna do something. Fuck no, that's bullshit. That is bullshit. You know from the start you were gonna do something about it. Because why? Because you guys can't do anything but fuck with my life instead of doing your job. And your job is not to intervene or interfere with people's outside lives. That's not your job. That's the cops and law's job. I don't see you guys having a badge. What? What? Like, for real? Just stop. Just stop it. Alright. So, new information has just come up. I now know who reported me, I now know why, but I'm not going to say their names, and I'm not going to say who said so, and I'm not going to say why, but I will tell you this, to the person that reported me, you recorded my video, my personal video in my private space, my audio as well, of me saying some things that you didn't like, none of it was threatening, you just did not like it, but here's the thing, it is against the law to record audio of a video footage privately recorded in a private area is illegal and against the law and the federal government takes that shit highly seriously so you might want to think twice well no it's kind of already too late you did show it to the public so yeah i'm taking you down whoever told them i'm taking you down along with that school and you guys will say, Jason, but you put the video out in the public. I don't care. I did it in the private of my own home. I don't care. What I'm getting at is that if I get in trouble tomorrow for recording private footage in my own private home that I put out to the public, then I'm going to piss in all of your graves. Because I am so done. And you guys wonder. And oh my God. Oh my God. And someone said <laughs> another thing just came back someone told me someone said oh and i bet he beat it i bet he beat penelope you really fucking think i beat my girlfriend i'm not aggressive you guys make me aggressive you guys made this monster you guys started all of this all of it and when i get in that fucking office tomorrow when i get in that office tomorrow i am not coming down there was no there's going to be no nice Jason. There's going to be raising hell Jason. And I promise you, this is no threat. This is no fucking threat.
because I'm not going to hurt anybody. I'm just saying I'm probably either going to hurt some feelings or because my words are very, very, very strong. And most of you know that. I swear to God. Can I have Jason Gibbs to Miss Lanchie's office? Oh my fucking God. Oh my fucking God. And Miss Yeager, you are not qualified to lead that council. You are not. You're missing so many perks. So many. So many qualifications. You don't have, you don't. You don't got the right attitude. You don't have the right mindset. You don't. And you always tell me to be a leader. How can I learn from someone who is not a leader themselves? You're a teacher. You're not a leader. Now, on the other hand, people do look up to me for leadership and guidance. Because I do my shit right. And Miss Harrison, I love you to death. I so love you. Out of you two, I would pick you, Miss Harrison, always. Because you're so nice. But you guys are like children. You guys are like kids. Because you go and tattletale and do things that don't even make sense. My 12-year-old brother does what you guys do. And you guys are straight adults. Female adults. Who literally take someone's videos and shows them to their authority. What? I have lost everything within a matter of seven hours. Within a matter of seven hours, I lost everything. My position on the council. That was my fault. I quit. And I'm sticking to it. My best friend, Crystal, also my fault. And I want to apologize to Mr. and Mrs. Garvey because what is going to happen tomorrow, people will probably be like, Damn, you, you treated him like a son. I truly do apologize to the people who don't deserve. To whatever I do, if it reflects you, I am so, I am so, so sorry. I truly am. It's that fucking corrupt high school. It's that corrupted high school. Ever since gang, ever since the gang has stirred up in there, they think a high school wants to target everyone now. Everyone. I'm probably the nicest, one of the nicest dudes who's cool that you're ever going to meet, but no. And, um, this is the last video of today. Uh, it's getting pretty late, and I've made enough videos and enough conflict. Or, no, I didn't make any conflict. Uh, I don't even know. Made enough conversation for today. But, to the people who did privately record my stuff and who are against what I had to say, and who have done me wrong over the past three things I've gotten in trouble for, I have privately recorded, I've recorded privately audio footage that I will be showing the, the not the council, the, uh, Dr. Murphy, and not even the APs. I can't even trust you APs anymore. I cannot trust you guys anymore. So no, I'm taking it to your boss. <sighs> I am so serious. I am so serious. And I know Dr. Murphy does not want to deal with this paperwork. I don't know. I don't care. But when he finds out what you guys did... Just because, like, literally what you guys said to me, literally people that you guys don't know, they gave me, they did something just because I said I had three vacation days. And so here's the other sneaky and tricky thing that the uh, APs had said to me in the day that I got suspended, no, the day that I had just got off my suspension. Remember, guys, when I posted on my story, three vacation days, yeah, they did something so off the books and out of context context that they told me that I was not allowed to say anything when I got out of that office. They said if I did, I would get more consequences. I'd get something worse than that. They said, Jason, we feel like that since you didn't learn your lesson, we're going to do this. You're not allowed to do that. And the fact that you didn't even write a pink slip and document it, you just did it under the table. You gave me a consequence under the table without a document. That is so wrong. And Dr. Murphy doesn't, he doesn't even know you did that. Oh, but he's going to. He's going to know. And he's going to care. Peace out, guys. Guys, I know I said that was going to be the last video, but you guys need to know this. The four people who reported me, girls, by the way, reported me because they didn't like what I had to say on my story. It's not the fact that I was drinking. It's because they didn't like what I had to say. They took it to offense. Even though I don't mess, I don't talk to any of these girls. I do not. And, mo and, these, and two of these girls are mute, meaning they don't talk to anybody. They don't talk to anybody. So why are you guys fucking on my life? Four girls. Cece, Rhiannon, Carl, and Tony, Lily DeLuca, and Elizabeth the Junior. Yep, you guys heard me.
those fucking four girls reported me because they didn't like what I had to say. So now, and I know, and I know now, know that now I know, I now know who to block. I truly do. I now know who's been giving my stuff to Miss Lynchy. I know who's been recording my stuff and sending it to Miss Lynchy. Shelby, I do apologize for accusing you of that, but the other ones are going down. <laughs>